We have some incredibly exciting news that could trigger a global shift toward positive change, not just in the United States. We're going to dive into the current occurrences that indicate a positive change in today's in-depth discussion. This development is nothing short of a breath of fresh air, especially in light of the recent stormy times marked by skyrocketing inflation rates, an alarming increase in unemployment figures, and a startling number of individuals losing their jobs, houses, flats, and money. We have really important news to give that will impact millions and millions of others in addition to you. What then is this wonderful news? It's truly wonderful news, not just good news. Please take a moment to click the like button if you find value in the daily information we provide for you before I get into the specifics. There have been a lot of changes over the previous year, making it an unpredictable journey. While some have been uplifting, others have been really upsetting. But as of late, the tide appears to be shifting as oil prices begin to decline, a development that many had been anxiously awaiting. You've probably heard the talk about gas prices falling dramatically if you've been watching the news or just keeping an eye on the price at the pump. These prices have plummeted by as much as 40 cents in certain areas in the last two days. In my neighborhood, the respite is represented by an approximately 30 cent decrease in petrol prices in just four days. This is a remarkable development because the price of practically everything we eat is largely determined by oil prices. It's reasonable to say that we're in for some good changes with the price of oil at around $1.85 a barrel, a sharp contrast to the prior price of over $1.90 just a week ago. Gas prices rise in tandem with the ongoing decline in oil prices, creating a cascading effect that affects the entire economy. One glaring illustration of this phenomena is the decline in transportation expenses. A recent visit through my neighborhood grocery shop left me shocked to discover that a package of cookies that used to retail for $5.99 was now only $1.99. And it's not just this one instance. Food prices have dropped by roughly 10% to 15%. In addition, travel expenses are decreasing as well. For example, a number of hotels are providing 10%, 15%, or even 25% off through online travel agencies. Energy prices are also rising as early snowfall in some areas indicates that future electricity and heating bills will be lower. However, these positive trends aren't just associated with eating and vacation. Many people find relief in the fact that their insurance prices will drop as a result of lower building costs. For example, the price of timber has decreased, which has resulted in lower insurance rates. The indicators are definitely positive. Even though it might be a little early to declare victory, especially for those who are worried about affordable housing. There's even more chance for good news as the holiday shopping season draws near. Many retailers have already stocked up on merchandise at increased costs, so customers might decide to postpone their shopping until the first quarter of 2024, when prices will be more fair. Although the economy may momentarily slow down as a result, this is encouraging in the fight against inflation, which is now running about 3.7%, with a 2% objective set by the Federal Reserve. There's more good news for people on fixed incomes, including Social Security recipients. The anticipated cost of living adjustment for 2024 is 3.2%, which is less than the significant 8.7% observed in 2023. This 3.2% rise, though, is fixed for the full year. This increase will exceed inflation if it declines as predicted, which is a positive result. The political scene is also changing. Recent developments like the Republican Party's choice for Speaker of the House have sparked worries about the possibility of a government shutdown. The government will stop spending more money if financing isn't obtained by November 17th. This move could help control inflation. In summary, this is a critical time, and although difficulties still exist, things are clearly looking up. I appreciate you watching, and if you want to receive more updates, I highly recommend that you subscribe to our channel. As these events develop, I'll be at your side at every turn to provide you the most recent information and analysis.